hey everyone welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a new Christmassy video and this video has been a long time coming because it's been ages since I've been and we're going to Neptune and it's going to be Christmas edition I'm going with my mum I'm super excited I'm hoping that there's just tons of cute Christmassy decorations and Christmas setups in all the showrooms I can't wait. So I'm gonna set off in a few minutes to go and pick mum up and head to Neptune. I've got a few Christmassy parcels that arrived yesterday from a really cute small business. So I'm gonna unbox them on camera now so you can see my live reaction and see what has arrived from this really cute small business called Home Pieces. So I'll do that on camera now and then I will head to Neptune. By the way, stood in front of the downstairs bathroom. I'm gonna show you what it currently looks like because it's a very exciting project that has been like in the running for months and months and we've just like been trying to find the time to do it but let me show you but obviously this is our hallway you'll have seen it all before like the console table there and in this door is our downstairs bathroom and it's by no means finished but I'm so excited look how cute it's looking already so we've got a brand new sink unit from bathroom mountain absolutely obsessed with it and it comes with like a like a top as well and then like a basin sink I'll probably show you when it's done like in another video but I just love that I need to get the handles on as well absolutely gorgeous colors like shaker style as well so pretty and then we've got a matching cupboard because this cupboard if you followed me on Instagram for a long time you might have seen I posted a story because I just find it so frustrating that all these annoying electrical things are that high up on the wall like who would put them there <laughs> do they need to be there like could they not have gone in the under the stair cupboard or like down there I just don't know like it, it's just one of the things that frustrates me so much about the house so obviously we can't have that on display so we need a cupboard and I think this one from bathroom mountain it matches that one. Oh, hello Bonnie do you want to come and see I think it just hides it all really nicely but obviously it looks a bit random that there's just a cupboard there on the wall so we're gonna make this whole wall into like a feature and have like two shelves and like style it up really cute we're going to have a mirror there and then the panel in doesn't it look so good I love it we've got this dado rail this is from Roomix DIY and they sent like everything that you need to do the panel in as well I just think it's fab and then this is just old panelling, tongue and groove panelling that my dad had and so we just got our builder to do it for us yesterday and I'm loving the progress so far so it probably won't be in this vlog but in another vlog I will update you on how the bathroom reno is going. Bonnie come out now. So just before I go and pick them up and head to Neptune, I thought I'd just do a little unboxing of some of these cute Christmassy bits that have arrived from a really gorgeous small business called Home Pieces UK. I'm just on my messages with her now and she says that you can get 10% off all of the Christmas things using the code Xmas10 and then it also gives you an extra 10% off the Christmas sale items which is really good. So let's just unbox the first thing which is in this plastic bag. A little stocking! So cute! I was actually wanting a stocking this year because I wanted to fill it with little like cute presents for Bonnie and I wanted like a really cute one that matches the decor as I might even like hang this on like the TV unit oh look it's got a little clip there so you can actually hang it on like hook it onto things which is really good so this is called the pom pom knitted stocking and it is adorable look at these two hanging pom poms it's all like cable knit it's white it's neutral all my favorite things oh I love it how cute is it going to be to pop all Bonnie's presents in this and she can open them on Christmas morning? <gasps> so cute! The presents are going to be in there. That's for Bonnie. <laughs> yeah. Okay, next is this big box and I think I know what this is. Um, I think it's going to be stunning. As you can see, I'm too lazy to go and get scissors so I'm just like ripping into it. <gasps> Oh my goodness. <gasps> this is stunning. Oh my goodness, look at that. That is gorgeous. That is going on my front door as soon as I've started filming this video. Oh my goodness, I love it. See, I've been after a faux wreath like this. It's like pine stems for ages because I've seen like loads on Instagram like small businesses and things and I've seen lots without the snow which I really like but this just adds like just a whole other level of Christmassy festive amazingness because the snow just looks so cute. This actually reminds me of a real wreath 
like it looks so realistic doesn't it it looks like you've just got these pine leaves from the forest like with snow on them and you just put them all together on a wreath it's like this at the back as well so it's really sturdy like a front door oh I don't even know if I want it on like the back of my front door like for people to see outside or if, whether I want it on the inside of the front door so I can see it all the time that'll be a big decision that I've got to make but I've, I'm just obsessed with it I think it's absolutely stunning and I've even just noticed that there's some little pine cones like dotted about just like really subtle to make it even more realistic. I love that so much. It's a really good size as well as you can see it's really really big sorry for all the noise but it's just chewing everything but with my discount code I think you can get it for only like £37 which for a big wreath like this that's like sturdy at the back like not flimsy or anything it's got all these leaves on that looks so cute it's got the pine cones on I think that's a really good price and yeah i'm just obsessed with it i love it and then for the last box i think it's some really cute pillar candles which i am excited about because i don't have anything like this and i think they'll make a really good like table display like centerpiece so let's get them unboxed i'm ripping the box again because i'm not going to get the scissors so here are the candles i think they come as a little set of three and they actually say rustic on the front which is always a good sign rustic led pillar candle with timer switch perfect and i'll just get them out of the cellar like the cellophane plastic stuff because these actually look really realistic they look like wax candles which i love because i'm not really a fan of like the led candles that are like a smooth plasticky finish on the outside i think they look a bit cheap looking and i think these ones look much more realistic so let me get them unwrapped so here's the largest one unwrapped and it actually feels like a wax candle it feels and looks like a wax candle doesn't it let me turn it on so you can see how it looks so you've got the option of four hour or eight hour and obviously you can just like turn it on and off so i've just realized that they don't actually come with batteries which is fine because not many things do come with batteries anymore and we don't have any double a's in the house so when i'm out at neptune i'll go to the shops pick up some batteries and then at the end i'll show you what they look like with bonnie see the wreath is so realistic that bonnie's eating the wreath she thinks it's real pine it's not real bonnie you'll get poorly if you eat that so yeah i'll either show you at the end what they look like like turned on or i'll insert it in this part of the video after this clip if that makes sense hey everyone this is chessie from the future please ignore the tv jake's playing his new pokemon game does anyone else's boyfriend play pokemon or is it just mine that's thinks he's still a big kid <laughs> but anyway here i mean you'll be able to see a little sneak peek of what i actually picked up at neptune today as this is now nighttime we're in the future but here are those gorgeous candles the led candles from home pieces with their batteries in all switched on and i honestly can't get over it doesn't it look don't they look like real candles and the light i don't know if it's picking up well on camera let me just adjust the settings a bit but the the flame actually flickers just like a real candle would. They look so realistic. I've just placed them here on my TV stand. I think they look really, really cute, but I also have an idea to put them in the middle of my dining table, like as a centerpiece. I've got so many ideas on how to use them, but I think all three of them styled here with some Christmassy bits as well. It looks adorable. Jake, would you just turn the lights out so I can see what it looks like with the lights off? <gasps> Ultimate cozy vibes. I love it. Don't forget you can get 10% off using the code Xmas10. So yeah, big thank you to Home Pieces for sending over those gorgeous Christmassy bits. I can't decide on my favourite. Um, I just love that wreath so much, but I love the stocking and I think these are going to look so cute when they're like flickering at night time. I just can't even decide my favourite. So if you like any of those pieces or you want to shop any of her other gorgeous pieces, don't forget you can use the code Xmas10 to save 10% and if they're already in the sale, I think you can get an extra 10% off those as well. So perfect. Okay, now I'm going to go and pick them up and head to Neptune. Off we go, I've got my Cub Rublé Christmas on for you. Mum's got a voucher as well, £40 voucher. I think you should split it with me. <laughs> you like all these new Christmas stems. Got a mistletoe twig, white berries, and I like those blueberries as well. The blue ones are nice. Yeah. They're cute as well. Yeah. Pine cone. Gold's nice. How cute are these napkins? The table looks super pretty. I love it. 
They are dead cute. I love that. So <laughs> the little got stockings. Them. I've got them. Have I you? got me them um, last Christmas and I put them on my tree. I love those. But I've, I just don't have red, but you have more traditional oh, colours. Oh, they're so cute. I love these just like stuck in the tree as well. And all the ceramics. I've just spotted this like a little gift set, That's like nice. bath and body. Rosemary and thyme. Oh, look at this little mouse. I know, I like the way they've um, got all the soft yeah. ties all up. Do you? Yeah. Like a donkey. Aww. You need him. <laughs> so <cute. laughs> oh, look. I have to ask Alice. Snowman. Oh, yeah. Cute. I really like how they put decorations on yeah. the jars. And then I love these like dried oranges in the jars. Mm -hmm. I might do that. Mm -hmm. Switch over like either my flower nice. or my oats for the Christmas period. It I looks so cute. Oh, where from? And then this looks really cute as well. I haven't even thought to do this, but it's just like a eucalyptus wreath. It's like a natural foliage wreath with fairy lights wrapped around to make it Christmas and festive. So these are the famous Neptune trees. I didn't even realise that they came in four sizes. I thought it just came in three sizes. I think I've got, I think I've got that one. <laughs> they are nice. I like them. The amber, amber and brown tones. But I think I'm going to get some more of these trees. I think I'm going to get that one and that one. I'm sure I've got that one. Or do I have that one? I'm sure it's that one. I think I'm going to get this baby one and this teeny, teeny, teeny baby one. <laughs> And then you've got these cute little star things. So you've got this star tea light holder. That's nice. Adorable. And then look at this, it's like a star candlestick holder. And then here are all are you numbering these or no? The gorgeous yeah, ceramic good. houses. Yeah. They're actually bigger than I remember actually. They're a really good size. I know that's so pretty, isn't it? So it's gonna be twenty four Mixed together with the white berries yeah. and they've got fairy lights. It's nice that we just branch. Yeah. And then they've got these cute decorations, so they've got all the felt ones, which are super cute, but I love these. I'm sure these weren't here last year, or well, they might have just all sold out, but I think I need one or two. <laughs> so these are those glass trees that I got last year. They are so cute on the tree, and just because of glass, you're just kind of blending with everything and just look really nice and classy. But I've just seen that they do these stars as well, and I didn't see these last year. And I think these are so cute, and I've got like a star theme on my tree with the white company stars and stuff, so I think I might get one of those as well. And then I've never seen these before either, but they're like a little candle hold, like you put a tea light in there. They've got snowflake ones, and then this one is adorable, a little star. I imagine at night time when you've just got the light shining through. And the hazelnut. What are they? They're the goring. Oh. And then the little stars are they. I'm sure I've got stars. Hazelnut. They're lovely, aren't they? You know, to They're put cute. In the, put in the dish. Yeah. Right then. Might are you going to get some? Might get some of them. What, the circular ones? Yeah. Oh, there's a dog. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> He's always here, isn't she? It's like the Polar Express. An angel gets his wings. <laughs> Is that what they say? Is that an old wives' tale? <laughs> that is really cute. I've got to get some of them. How cute does this look? If you've got like a big island like this, I could only dream of something like this in my kitchen. But how stunning! Just this everything in the middle. Perfect. <laughs> oh, I love that. It's the perfect. Please help yourself. Hmm. What does that mean? Oh! <laughs> I thought we could take a present. Oh, they're Yeah, they are. See, I still got some of this wrapping left from last year. Yeah. I like how this. Is it like an advert calendar thing? I even love how they've got baubles just on the shelves up here. Like, and it all just matches. It matches with the food. Look at the baubles on the shelves. I wouldn't even think to do that. Why are you whispering? <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Yeah, they're nice too. Mm. This looks cute as well. I've got this and I just think these gold berries look really nice just coming out. I'm a big fan of just like single stems coming out of these small vases. You can just hear those bells. <laughs> look at this cute display. This is such a pretty tablescape. 
that big Christmassy display, but you've, they've got the Christmas trees, different sizes in the middle. I love that idea. And look at these napkins. I've seen loads of these on Instagram, like the Christmas tree style napkins. We need to try that. We keep just seeing like the Christmas trees just dotted everywhere, like the different sizes. And now I feel like I need to get like five of each size <laughs> so I can dot them all over the house. Like they just look so stunning, like mixed with all like the pillar candles and the, like the candle holders. I love it. More bells. More bells for mum. <laughs> they are dead cute. I'm going to get one of those. Oh, there's different kinds. There is. They're so nice. Oh, have a look in here. Ooh, look at these paper stars. I don't think they're for sale. I think they've been made, but look, they've, can make it's out of the Neptune wrapping. You know, you know how you make them? You could easily make them. Really? Yeah, you fold them in a certain way and you cut. Oh, yeah. And that's, that's how you make them. They look cute. Mm -hmm. Another gorgeous tablescape. This is all like green vibes, like dark forest green. Really cute crackers. And they've just got like a sprig of mistletoe on the plate as well. Yeah, Some have a nice. bauble, oh, I like that. Yeah, that's nice. Instead of doing all the yeah. green that I did last year down the centre, I might just um, dot some of them around. Yeah, um, but it's kind of like mishmashy, rustic style. Yeah, it's nice. I love it. They're those um, oh, yeah. placemats. Yeah. Cute, simple Christmas styling. Like, this is just so simple. It's literally three things on a chopping board, a candle, ceramic, a glass vase, and some mistletoe, but doesn't it look super pretty? Yeah. Oh, I love it. With the books under the... Yeah. The books under Oh, this looks so cosy. <laughs> you like, it wouldn't even think to just no. display lights like that, but it just looks really it cute does. and cosy. Look at that Christmas tree. <gasps> pretty. If you're going for like a rustic, like chocolate vibe, these decorations are all super cute. Mum's getting some of these bells. And then this is like a little candle wreath. And then these gold stars. They're super cute. How cute is this for like a round table, even like a rectangular table? Just a table runner, some foliage made into a garland, and some little houses dotted around. That is cute. All the stockings on the ladder. I could do that with my ladder. You but I'm not buying all those stockings. We've got some Christmas foliage nice. hanging up. I love that. Uh, yeah. I love Tongan Groove. <gasps> Jake is going to kill me. And Dad is going to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> we cannot be stopped when we come to Neptune, can we? So I will show you everything that I picked up when I get back home. Won't be able to do a haul of mum's stuff. But look how cute these, this foliage is that she got. So the white berries and the mistletoe stems. And she's gonna do a display in a hallway, aren't you? And hang those baubles on. Yeah, with some um, tree branches. Oh yeah. <laughs> Exciting. So we're just in the car now, we always love coming to Southport Neptune. If you're close by or it's like not too far a drive, I would definitely recommend the Southport one because the staff are just so friendly, aren't they? They know us now, they're like, we're like the regulars at Neptune. <laughs> and yeah, it's just a really pretty store. There's loads of rooms, they always decorate it really nicely. And I've never been to the Nutsford one, actually. You've been, haven't you? Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, Mel says it's nice. Cafe at Nutsford as well. I need to go to the Nutsford one soon, but Southport one is our fave. Hey guys, I'm back from Neptune and I'm just in the hallway. I just thought I'd have a setup in the hallway for a change. I'm just sat on like a tiny room chair in the hallway, but I thought the setup was quite cute. We have the Christmassy garland and my bouquet and the hoop from B&M that was literally five pound and looks identical to the white company one amazing so yeah i thought i would just set up in the hall to show you what i got from neptune i got a new color bag it's like i'm not sure on the actual official name but it's just like a dark forest green color very very christmasy and festive so yeah jake is in the lounge and he asked me how much did you spend at neptune and i wouldn't tell him but now he's probably just gonna hear me like talk about all of these things so so yeah i did go a little bit a little bit OTT at Neptune. I could have gone way worse, like my mum did worse than me. She bought more than I did. So I restricted myself a little bit, but I did get some amazing goodies. So let me 
open everything up and show you. It's all festive related, by the way. It's all Christmassy, so I'm so excited. So firstly, I got these two glass star ornaments for the tree or I thought even like you know when you've got like a display of branches and like you can hang little tiny decorations off the branches I thought they could possibly go on there too but some of you might remember last year if you are like early followers of my YouTube that I got the tree the Christmas tree versions of these last year in like two different sizes and I, I'm sure that these are new because I, I don't remember seeing these last year these little stars I think they are so cute so I got two of those and they were £8 each so not like the cheapest decorations in the world but I thought they were lovely and very unique like I've not seen these in any other shop and they've got the signature like velvet ribbon from Neptune as well and they'll match the trees if I decide to put them on the tree or I think they'll look super cute so I'm like a little hanging arrangement in a bouquet so yeah got two of those and then I also got some more of those little ceramic Christmas trees that everyone knows from Neptune so I have I didn't realize you may have heard me in the store I didn't realize that those trees came in like a teeny a small a medium and a large or it might be like extra large large medium small I didn't realize that they came in four and I think I've got like the the second biggest already is it on there yeah it's here so I've got this one already I got this one last year but I want like, I kept seeing on all the Neptune displays I'll just pop it back one second I kept seeing when I was walking around the showroom that they just had like all these trees in different sizes like just placed randomly like on a sideboard or on a dining room table or on an island I, would, I just loved how they looked like the different heights and the different sizes I just think it looked super cute so I got a range of trees so I got one of these little baby ones how cute is that this one was five pounds so that's quite affordable just for a cute little baby tree like this I also got a second one of that size like the second biggest size just because I keep moving that one like from room to room so now I've got two to play around with so I got another one of those and then I also got got a really big tree this one was 16 pounds this is the largest one and the one down from that is 12 pounds so it's just like a little size comparison there this one is actually quite a lot bigger so yeah I got a big one as well and then I got two of the second smallest ones as well so yeah a range of trees there I'll probably style some together I'll probably style some on their own I'll probably mix and match it up during December to be honest and like try different things out but I've got them now and they're just like I know I say this all the time but when you get neutral pieces like this they're just so classic and timeless you can get them out every year because white ceramic pieces will never go out of style in my opinion so yeah I'll have these forever now and I love them all. I also got a set of these little hanging ceramic houses and the ladies at Neptune said this that this little set was new so I love those and each house is like white and ceramic but they're all a little bit different so you've got this one with like two windows like a double fronted kind of house and then you've got this one which is kind of like a longer house and then this one I really like they're going to match my living room tree really nicely as I just go for white like neutral vibes and it was three for ten pound which isn't too bad for like a solid little decoration like this so yeah love those I also decided to get a little tea light house. Now I know I've got the Hobbycraft ones and the Hobbycraft ones are such a good dupe. If you, I mean, how much was this? It was £10, so it's like £5 more than the Hobbycraft ones. So not you're not like breaking the bank getting a Neptune one. The Hobbycraft ones are a really good dupe, but they're not glazed, whereas this one is glazed. And I'll probably style this one on its own, like not with my village that I've got on my windowsill. I'm thinking this one for like my TV stand like just to look dead cute and Christmassy like when you're watching TV you can pop a little tea light in the back it's got a starry roof as well and I just love that there's tons of windows on the front because all the light will just shine through and look really cozy and cute so I did I did cave I did get a tea light house from Neptune <laughs> and then the last thing that I got was kind of like a spare of the moment thing because I was I was looking at them on my way around and they did look so gorgeous and I love the colour and then I just thought yeah I'm just gonna get it I'll treat myself so it's this gorgeous tea light holder in the colour moss it's called the Kimmeridge tea light holder in moss it was 26 pound but I think it's really stunning and looks very Neptune like you can tell it's like Neptune vibes and it's got like kind of like speckled 
little bits all along the all like all around the outside and I feel like when you have the candle in there all the light will just shine through those little bits those little holes so I think this will look gorgeous I'm thinking this for my con uh, for my tv stand as well just because I feel like the green will match like the tree and everything I could even have it like in here matching the garland and things there's lots of possibilities of where I could put it but it is really gorgeous and it was a little bit of a splurge but I really do love it so that was everything that I got from Neptune. I hope you enjoyed seeing all of the Christmassy bits that I picked up and also seeing like what Neptune shop looked like as well. Like it was so gorgeous in there. All the downstairs rooms were all decorated for Christmas and my mum and I were getting so many good ideas on like how we could style our houses up. Like the baubles on the shelf is such a good idea. Like for a kitchen, just like mix with all your jars. And I'm definitely going to get some of those like dried orange slices for my kitchen jars as I really loved how that looks in the Neptune showroom so lots of good styling ideas in the showrooms as always leave me a comment down below let me know which pieces you were loving the most from Neptune or from home pieces at the beginning there's some gorgeous Christmassy bits all throughout this video so let me know what you were loving the most and I will see you very soon in a new Christmassy video bye